Hey guys, SMD Charizard here, also known as Aaron, and this is my Pokemon Journey Tag video. So I've been tagged, like I said, in one of my Shadow Saturday. I've been tagged by my friend Crimson Shadow, and basically I'm gonna be asking. Uh, I mean, I mean, I'm gonna be answering six questions, and I have them right in front of me, right here. And I will also have the images of the questions up in the corner, right above here, um, because. It is from a YouTuber named Super Nerd Daniel, and I, he he is a great guy. So he originally made this. So yeah, and basically I wanted to do it too because like like I said, I was tagged, and because it was really interesting. So some of these questions I might not uh, get, but you know, let's just get on with the video. So yeah. So the first question is. When did you start playing Pokemon and what was your first game? So, my first game was... So, my first Pokemon game that I played was Pokemon Diamond and I started playing back in 2000, uh, 2009 when I was in the Philippines and I would have shown you my game right now but I can't find where my um... I usually have this... Uh, my cousin has this little like patch or <clears throat> this bag like small pouch kind of and it has my uh, my and her Pokemon games and Pokemon that she has her Pokemon diamond they're my Pokemon diamond um uh, my brother has it back in the Philippines he finished it and basically yeah that was my first Pokemon game and I started playing Pokemon in 2011 so let's get into the second question so the second question is boom have you ever legitimately legitimately completed the Pokédex in a Pokémon game? Yeah, I legit legitimately completed the Pokédex back in Pokémon uh, Diamond. Uh, <clears throat> basically, well, I had a little help. Basically, when I started playing it uh, halfway through, or I think a little towards the end and stuff, I kind of like haven't played it in a while. And then my brother started playing it, and he actually got Arceus for me. He, it's my uh he's the second young uh second youngest kid in my family but i think um i think he, I, how do i not know my brother's age i think he's 18 i'm not i'm not sure but yeah he played pokemon but now nah, i don't think he doesn't anymore um but i still do so yeah i i legitimately completed the pokédex in pokemon diamond Others, oh, um, basically, I've no, uh, I didn't play any other Pokemon games that uh, back then, but pretty much, yeah. So let's get into the next one. <laughs> but I meant next one. I mean next question. So the next question is, boom. If you were a gym leader, what type would you specialize in, and what would be your ace Pokemon? So of course, you guys could probably guess what my Pokemon, uh, what type. I mean, I would specialize in. And that would be fire type because fire type isn't just cool, but usually sometimes some fire types are kind of a some big advantage to other types, but sometimes they're not. And some fire types have two types at once, so of course you know what my ace Pokemon be because it's in my name. But that would be Charizard because Charizard doesn't just have a cool design and is not just a fire type, but is also a, f a flying type. Which means it's good against um, like a bunch of uh, types. Like fire is good against steel. Flying against flying is good against bug. Fighting, like you know, you know what I mean. But yeah, Charizard would be my ace Pokemon, and I would specialize in the fire type. So let's get into the next question. So the next question is, boom. What has kept you a fan of the franchise for all these years? So. What well, basically what made me like stay and like Pokemon for all these years is because it's not be like the game mechanics uh, have mostly been the same all around the year uh, the the years of Pokemon. But basically the reason why I was a fan because the creatures and Pokemon's they weren't just cool. They had their own personalities and everything. But I love their designs and usually I love seeing new Pokemon's being created. Even if it's not the best, but you know, it's like I enjoy it because 
you don't know what it's like to use all the different Pokemons because th since there's a bunch maybe you haven't even tried this Pokemon or that Pokemon but you know what I mean but like that's the reason why I've been a huge fan through all these years the designs the mechanics all the people you meet and that's including Wally because Wally's a scrub just kidding but yeah because I don't know I literally just love meeting all the characters the char the Pokemon designs even through like sometimes when you're completing the game or you're about to lose a Pokemon battle it would get intense like you know and then like whenever you win that uh, like tough battle you'd be like yes yes like you know what I mean so yeah let's get into the next question and the next question is if you could change one thing about the Pokemon games what would it be so one thing I would change about the Pokemon games is usually I want a new mechanic every time but that not like every time but basically like not just a mechanic or source or of new or some kind but basically it's not just they I don't want them to make it more interesting by adding new things but also like recently Pokemon these days sometimes some of the Pokemon's they make are just terrible I mean terrible like the old, like, the old gen Pokemons, they're, th those designs were amazing, but nowadays, some of the designs of some Pokemons are just terrible, like, I know there's a lot of people that make, like, fan-made Pokemons, and some of them, like, shouldn't be made because either, you know, they don't look at it, or either it's too inappropriate, because, you know, the whole game is still supposed to be kid-friendly, but, yeah, I would really want them to add something new each time in the game, not, like, by Pokemons and stuff but their designs or you know what I mean it's hard to explain but basically yeah that, that's what I'm saying so let's get <clears throat> to the next question so the next question is Ben assuming the franchise continues for that long do you think you will still play Pokemon 20 years from now well yes if they're still running up and running uh, for uh, you know that if it continues for that long, I, I probably still will. It, uh, I st the first game, I uh, like actually to be uh, to be uh, to be honest, when I first uh, st uh, played on the DS and the Nintendo DS, Pokemon was actually the first game I ever played, and the thing is like I've always enjoyed it, and every time I play and I complete the game, not just not like the whole Pokedex, but like the, the game temp. Normally, I usually restart it every time and always have new Pokemon, you know, you know what I mean? Like, it's it's really, it's like, basically it's my childhood. Um, when I, it's my childhood, like, you know, it's my most favorite game. It's like, I don't know, I always liked it whenever I hear it or I look, I see videos or when I look at it. It's just like, I start talking about it and everything, it's just like, I don't, I don't know, it's, I, I really just li uh, really like it, and I still will play, even if it lasted that long. Cause I, but I don't know if they, if, you know, if, if it'll continue that long, but when I grow up, maybe if I have my own children or something, it could be something we could bond together and they could enjoy. But yeah, let's get into the next, uh, the last one, actually. So, the three, the last question is... What three people do you tag to do this tag video next? So the three people I'm picking to uh, uh, I tagged on this video is uh, Nate Wick. <clears throat> I, I will have his YouTube channel. I will have all the links to these channels in the description down below. Um, the first one is Nate Wick. The second uh, channel is Dragon Tamer Nathan. And finally, the third person that I tagged this video is Muddy Fins. Yes, you Muddy Fins, you better do this. Cause like this guy named Muddy Fins actually, he he gets like over a hundred to two or like five hundred views, but he only has like seventy subscribers or something. So I was like, like you know, this guy deserves more. But you know, that's out of the question. Besides that, but yeah, guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you hit that. Uh, blah. You hit that like button and subscribe if you're not subscribed to my channel yet. And as always, I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.